Hi guys, so you joined me on a winter's afternoon and not really got much to do at the moment with the bikes and certainly no riding because I've laid them all up. Um, but what I thought I would do is just give you a bit of an insight as to a design concept or an actual product that the previous owner of this bike made himself. So I bought the bike from a guy called John in Scotland. We stay in touch a little bit as well, which is quite nice. Uh, it was really hospitable to my grandparent and my grandfather and my dad when they went up. And apparently, you know, you could just tell this is the sort of guy that you want to buy a bike from. Ex-engineer, you know, very meticulous in what he does. And um, as part of the, the output of the rebuild, he was given, given back the old parts, the old pistons and comrades. And he actually manufactured or, you know, engineered uh, a lamp fitting. So here it is. And it's really cool, actually. So, and he gave me a nice little handwritten note as well which is um really 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 nice actually so this is the uh, this is the piston i've got it on a little bit of a display it doesn't stay here normally i'll uh, put a picture later as to in the motorbike appreciation room as i like to call it so i'll back up a little bit because we're a bit close there so that's it and i think he's handmade all the um all the, the, the stained glass as well which is pretty cool actually a lot more handy than i am so we've got inscribed as well i'm not sure whether you can see i'm trying not to put too much stress on the top of this 1961 bsa a10 uh, that's the piston there the rings you know all the original ones i think if we move around the back as well i just tie, had to tie wrap um that because it's uh, just the nature of it i've also got Super rocket etched in. You can just about make it out. Rocket there and super just under here. So, yeah. If you're watching, John, thank you again for your generous gift. Uh, I think he said his son's got the other one, so that, that's really cool. But, you know, just to offer this up, wouldn't even let me pay for the postage to have it, have it sent over. You know, and this will stay with the bike now as a, as a nice piece of history. Um, you know, and that I can pass down through through my family. So, um, so yeah, there's an idea for you. If you ever get your bike rebuilt, you know, you can use some of the old parts and make things around the house. So thanks for watching and catch you on the next one.